I'm in the civil unrest in my home country, which is located in West Africa. Uh, my family and I migrated to uh, the United States. Uh, first stop was Minnesota, of all places. Uh, we moved around a lot afterwards, but we learned to acclimate and assimilate to the culture and trying to find where we could call home now. Uh, and that's when I start considering the Army, and uh, it wasn't really the first thing that everyone wanted to hear, uh, especially since the, there was a war. I, I left a war for a reason. So coming here and trying to serve in the military was shocking for everyone. Uh, they wanted me to do school, go to school, get scholarships, get an education, get a really great job. And that's, that's what your assignment is. Leave the Army to other people that want to be soldiers. But that wasn't what I wanted to do. I just wanted to make a difference. I wanted to be part of the 1% and really change the, the perception of who or the, you know, how people see me. And I had to change my mindset in order to get there and shift myself in the person I really wanted to become. And um, in doing so, I learned a lot about myself, a lot about discipline, and a lot about just leadership. And one of the things, the biggest learning was that in various situations, I'm not always going to have the support of everyone. And what I need to do is just keep pushing. And it's okay when you don't have people supporting you. Your job is not to convince them. It's to just do what you think and believe is the right thing to do. <laughs>